I'm Jody with Campers Inn in Byron, Georgia. I'm here to celebrate the 10th anniversary of Grand Design with their Imagine 2500 Rear Living, one of the number one sold travel trailers in the industry for four or five years now. Come on, let me tell you more about it. One of the first things I like about the Imagine, they do a drop frame rail in the pass-through storage the same way they do their fifth wheels. With a drop frame rail, I've got that much larger door. I can take those larger chairs in an unobstructed pass-through storage and load it up with my table and chairs and anything else I want to take care of. Notice the thickness of this door. This door is solid foam insulation on the inside. That's a lot of coffee cups. They do the slam latch to make life a lot easier. Come on, let's talk about making life easier. Grand Design does the 20 pound tanks instead of the 30 pound tanks because they want it to be easy. They want you to be able to rest. And it's much easier to find a exchange station instead of a field station. That's why they went with a power tongue jack, taking that weight distribution hitch on and off. Much easier with a power tongue jack. Come on with me. We got an other side of the pass-through storage, the same thing door on this side, the same amount of coffee cups on the outside, magnetic strip that's going to hold it up. This is my enclosed docking station. Enclosed docking station, I no longer have to hang my water hose on the side. I'm going to run my water hose up through the bottom, hook it into a city water connection here. You've got one at home, it's called a water hose. Outdoor showers located right here. Remember that battery that always went dead because you never disconnected it? Battery disconnect on the outside. So my battery's no longer gonna run dead. They have features like the fresh water feel here, but also when my city water connection hooked up, I can just turn this by here to fill up my fresh water tank. You talking about easy and relaxation? There you go. I've got a black tank plus here. I got a multiple directional sprayer inside that black tank that's going to help me keep that black tank fresh and non-smelly. And of course, most of the time when I arrive to the campground, it's dark outside. So this is going to be extra light to be able to hook my hoses up in the middle of the night. This slide wall here, I like to talk about the slide walls. All the competitors that I've seen here, I can push this slide wall in two or three inches at a time. Grand Design does a laminated side wall. And with that laminated slide wall, I've got stability. I've got insulation. They did the roof of the slide the same way. Come on. No need for 50 amp here. No need for a second AC. If I talk about the insulation, the house I built eight years ago is an R28. That's some of the best residential insulation in the industry. Let's talk about grand design. Front cap, R40. The roof. And our 40 slide floor. Slide floor has insulation. With Grand Design, it's an R23. So no need for a 50 amp per second AC. So 30 amp is gonna save you money at the campground because it doesn't need that second AC. 30 amp, 30 foot long. Come around the back, a lot of the industry have gone away with the ladders. Most of my friends still want a ladder just to be able to do their own general maintenance on the roof. Most of the people I've met in the past 13 years in the industry would normally go buy best tires on the way home and put the new tires on. Green Design thought of that. It's all about relaxation. It's all about rest. So what they did, they went with the tire of choice and it's called a Goodyear Endurance. So I don't have to stop on the way home. There's a five year warranty on this 10 plot tire. This is my furnace exhaust. I love the furnace exhaust being on the door side because if mama locks me out and it's cold enough on the inside to have the furnace on, I can stay warm on the outside. And this may look a little different to you. This is a tankless water heater. I no longer have to get wet and lather up, turn the water on and off to get clean, to save water. The tankless water here is almost like endless hot water for those long showers. Output for a TV. Of course, we gotta watch the game under the owner. We can't miss the game. So I have an output here, and then I have a plug in here. So check your little TV on the table outside for enjoyment. And let's go on in the inside. So it's the end of the night. Most of the day we spend inside camping. So what I wanna do now, I wanna sit down in my Thomas Payne recliner. I wanna kick my feet up and turn on the heat for my back pain and the massage. Hey, the football game is on. It's all about relaxation. If you notice above my head, 
Green Design does the nicer blackout blinds, opposed to some of the cheaper that we've seen in the industry. So, so top quality, very, very nice. You're kind of seeing some of the reasons why the Imagine's been one of the number one sold in the industry. So, I've been in some campers where we had to run a lot of extension cords all around. So let's talk about outlets. We've got an outlet there with two plug-ins. We've got an outlet there with two plug-ins. We've got an outlet there with two plug-ins. And let's look over here. In the booth down in, I've got two USBs. Can't have enough plugs and Grand Design thought of that because they thought of you. So in the back of the table, everybody needs a table to take outside when you go camping. When you're out there watching the TV, or this could be the table that you set your TV on outside. This is a freestanding low down table, so I don't have to take an extra table with me now. I've got it right here, and back here kind of hidden. There's a little secret back here that people forget about or don't know about. This is a, a removable bench. It can go on the outside. There's also some hidden storage in this that's pretty neat. I can also use it as a little ottoman. Storage, storage, storage. We got under bench storage. And as we're coming around the same direction, let's talk about the refrigerator. Grand Design has updated their refrigerator to a 12 volt, 110, 10 cubic foot refrigerator. I no longer have to run propane when I'm in trouble. Or I no longer have to run propane when I don't have electricity. This is 12 volt, it's gonna run off the batteries on the front. What's gonna keep my batteries charged? Well, did I tell you that? We also have solar panels now on top of the Imagine that's gonna keep your 12 volt charge to run my refrigerator. Coming on around, talking about space, we have a counter extension. How about this? Mama always wanted me to wash the dishes, but I didn't have no way to drain them. So somebody had to come out with this. So I got that there, that's still a cover, but I can fold that back and she found a way that I could finally rinse the dishes, so I guess I gotta do it. So, you notice the nice cabinets? Hidden hinges all the way around like you see. Stove top cover. Doubles as a back splash. And of course my TV's on a pull out swing on a bracket, so when I'm washing the dishes or I'm sitting in my recliner, I can watch it from either direction. So, one thing I want you to notice is, I see a rollator in my day or a wheelchair in my day someday and, and I just noticed the wide entry doors that Grand Design does into the bathroom and into the bedroom. Nobody does that. They do a barn door. Maximizes your space. Come on in. How about a porcelain toilet in your camper opposed to a plastic one? How about the where it's located? Hey, I've got the whole universe in front of me here. So porcelain instead of plastic. Shower doors. I'm talking about the, the barn doors. Let's talk about the shower door. The shower door. Look at this door. Isn't it great? Let me tell you how great it is. It does not motor mill do. It squeegees from the inside. Leaves the water on the inside and not the outside. The fabric. It has a five-year warranty on the fabric. But... If little Johnny does mess it up, you can open the door here and pop that out and pop a new one in. Easy. Did we talk about easy and relaxation? We've got the same blinds throughout. You'll see some of the competitors maybe do the good blinds in the back, but not in the front. Grand Design puts it throughout. Come on into the wide entry door into the bedroom. You'll notice that the mattress is 80 inches long. Did you buy that camper where your feet hung off the end, 72 or 74 inch? Shoot a bottle and imagine. Their mattresses are 80 inches long. Take your tape measure out now and measure your mattress at home. It's 80 inches, 80 inches, so 60 by 80. And what's the most important thing to you? Laying in the bed at night? Your phone, your iPad. So I've got 110 outlets on both sides in my cubbies. I've got USBs in both cubbies because you know that's kind of important to you. I've got all this storage here. There again with nice finishes, hidden hinges. Just take everything from the house. Look at the storage under the bed. They have a slide tray that has a locking mechanism where it won't move going down the road. You have to lift it to unlock it when you get there and it slides across. 
Now you know why everybody's excited about Grand Design. Why everybody's excited about Imagine. I'm Jody with Campers In. 478-258-1008. 478-258-1008. Come join us.